Now, the second part of that that I referred to earlier is making space for her emotions. So, you know, if you, if she's upset and she's right, 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 and you just shut down, like you withdraw by pulling out of the conversation or you kind of go stony, you're like there, but not there. She's going to be like, oh, it's going to be painful for her because you're not available for her emotions. Uh, the granddaddy of them all that most guys do on a regular basis is defensiveness so she comes with some emotional expression some upset and then we get defensive we try to explain we, try, we go to that informational level so that's what defensiveness is like she comes with emotion and we respond with information and it's like two different languages because she's in an emotional state she cannot receive this new information you're trying to give her she can't hear it so you might as well be speaking french to her so defensiveness is another way that, that uh, men often operate. And it's just a dagger in our women's heart because they're, th then they say, I, I can't share my upset. All he does is try to change my mind and tell me not the way that it, to feel that I already feel. And that's one of the ways that women feel very emotionally unsafe because they start sharing less and less of themselves because they don't feel like it'll be received. And that's when the, the, also the relationship starts to really shut in on itself when she feels like she can't share who she really is which includes all of her emotional experience.